movies or anime episodes that's beyond the regular length of 20 minutes are patreon exclusive content for men for reasons i've mentioned before for example if it takes a fucking hour to watch the anime episode that's three times the time i gotta put in to compare to a regular video three times the effort to edit that means on that day i can only make one video it fucks up my content schedule and i wanted to give my you know paying members on patreon some exclusive perks but i think i'll make a compromise i want to make you guys my free-to-play warriors on youtube a little bit happy too and i think the compromise will be i will edit the movie duration down to like 10 minutes it's not going to be like those regular movie reactions i did in the past no no no. it'll be like highlight reels out of context just like a little teaser right so please enjoy the mohoka ov where OVA where we're gonna witness the glory of Onisama as a child 12 year old kid the demon of Osaka was it let's begin today's reaction wait this is little Miyuki and I think that was uh Yotsuba Mills little Miyuki and little Onisama in the shittiest plane spot that sucks I wonder if he's killed the person at this age right now is he secret agent right now god damn look at her what's her name Maya Uncomfortable? Are, damn, they just treat him like a fucking bag boy. But Miyuki doesn't like Onisama right away, huh? Damn, that's his mom. She is so hot, my god, bro. Oh my god. Huh. You are his mistress. <laughs> this family knows how to fucking rule, dude. That's such a matriarch. All the women just like step on the guys. Oh, we're just looking at you. What? Oh my god! She would beg for her to, him to like stare at her before. Sorry, in, in, in you know where we are right now in the story. Any, anyways, Miyuki's so tsundere. I, I don't know what, what is she doing. Is she just shy, nervous? I'm just really happy about meeting Miyuki's mom. She's so hot. Oh god, this is gonna be some fan service moment. No, you shouldn't do that. She's too young for this shit. Don't show it. Don't show it. I want to put the sunscreen on the mom, though. Leave it for the imagination. Which part? You said the front to yourself! I'm pretty sure she's just wiping it fucking all over her back. Inside your skirt. Only Sama, don't get in there. Let's go on a walk. He just stares. <laughs> he just stares. <laughs> What the fuck is this? <laughs> Took me a second to realize what's going on there. Or is she? Oh, careful, truck kun. Oh, what the? This is a big black dude. Okay, he just tanned. He's just super tanned. I think there's like American soldiers, right? Look at him. There's like a typical blonde macho dude. American, okay, forces exactly. But like, wait. These are like grown ass soldiers, military men bullying like this, what, like 12 year old kid? Oh, Onisama. Demon rights. Oh, what do you got right now? Fucking cut their arms off. Material boss to activate. Fucking this. Does Onisama have Taijutsu training with the ninja? Baldy ninja? Oh. Damn, that's a little bit of a threat. Dude, these grown-ups, look at their sizes, man! Uh, he doesn't back down. <laughs> okay, okay! Some basic taijutsu, maybe? He blocked it. This is insane. You're fighting like kids. It's like elementary school kids! Oh shit, he stands up. You gotta pose. To provoke? No, watch. Just watch. He is a boss. Dude, this is insane. <laughs> it's just a kid fight. Damn! Clean hit. Internal damage, maybe? Because the punch itself didn't seem heavy, but there was some impact. Get fucked, Joe. So it's all about power. Just because she thought that he was weaker than her, she was like, what the fuck can you do for me? But now, ever since that one punch, she's like, oh my god, Onisama. No, say Onisama. Ani. Not Onisama, but Ani. We're getting there. Baby steps, baby steps. Hmm. What the fuck? Your own place. I don't really understand why he's treated like this. Really? You're feeling that bad now? Bitch, you straight up said. 
I don't need this dude. He's weaker than me. I wish he'd leave me alone. I'm gonna relieve him. And now you're just like, what? You don't think I'm your little sister? What is the mission? <laughs> She's all over the place, dude. <laughs> How dare he smile? <laughs> She's actually getting so jealous. Mom. When does she die? And when does the maid die? She just has the presence of a highly esteemed MILF. You know, Miyuki's mom is everything I want in like a MILF character. Oh my god. Now, lollicons exist, but what's the opposite term for MILF? Does a MILF con exist too? That'd be kind of awkward picture. Wait, the mom just stared at the... the she's like, did you just suggest that? How dare you? How dare you have these kids have memories? Would mom allow a picture? We even call her madame, not mom. <laughs> awkward. <laughs> Look at the distance between them. That's so fucking awkward, dude. Oh. What's going on? Are we under attack? Submarine? Onisama, get in there. Underwater missile. What are you going to do with torpedoes? What are you going to do? Onisama. What does he have at this current moment? Can he just deconstruct the missiles like he does with the bullets? What do you do? Yeah, he can. So he already has this. Crazy shit. Now, if Miyuki was a little bit more experienced, she could have just frozen it, but... Goddamn. Even right now, Onisama could just, like, defeat guns. He just breaks them apart. How does he do it? Military magic, right? Hmm? What? Wait, are those the same people? <laughs> Isn't this the guy that we beat? It's fucking Joe again! <laughs> Is this how we get recruited into the military? Joe, you're so different in the military outfit. What the fuck? <laughs> Before you're like, you wanna fucking go, kid? <laughs> Insane. I wonder what he's actually thinking. Dude, the mom's outfit? She, I, We're just at home eating. Casually. Her outfit's like always just ready. She's just like always ready to go to some extremely luxurious dinner ball or something. Look at this! Oh my god! How the fuck did Tatsuya's dad even get this, bro? You're like what? Just started middle school. What is that? Like fucking grade 7, 8, 9? Bro, how old is he right now? He's like fucking... Like grade 8, 7, 8... That's like 12, right? Judo flip! <laughs> Ask him, you wanna get in there? <laughs> yeah, let's. Hey, sh hey, Tatsuya, 12 year old kid I just recruited for the military. You wanna come fucking fight against these grown ass men? Like, we know he can do it, but it's just bizarre. Oh shit. And he brought out Sergeant. It's a pretty big title, right? I wonder what he's thinking. You serious? You want me to fight this 12-year-old? Are you fucking insane? A boxer at the national level? I'm sure he just stress testing. He really wants to see how strong is Onisama right now. But again, just think about it. This is a fucking 12-year-old kid. <laughs> Easy on me, my ass, bro. He's kind of teasing, but... Only Look, look at this. Is this the Ninja Baldi training? What is that? He just goes huh. Internal damage? Because it doesn't seem very strong. But it looks like it destroys from within. Okay. Captain, now sergeant. Now captain. Okay. Only oh, someone beats the shit out of more people. Oh shit, he's coming with a kick. Yo, you should get in there, you coward. You get in there too. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. Shoot a flip. Damn. Yeah, he's cool, right? He's really cool, right? Damn, look at that sportsmanship. Joe again? Joe, really? You want to do this? Alright. Alright. <laughs> Revenge against a 12 year old kid. <laughs> okay, sure. No, Joe. <laughs> Joe, are you serious? You want to fight this 12 year old kid again? Oh. Ah, he needs it. 
Huh? It's fine. They love it. They love this shit from Onisama. And she is worried about the Miyuki part. Oh my god, you call me by my first name. What? Ooh. I don't know what that was, but it just looks like he shot like a force wave. Pretty cool. Even they're surprised there. Oh, and he's not. Miyuki go like this is everybody, dude. It's us right now. We are Miyuki. <laughs> Gram demolition is that magic? He's not a dick anymore. What the fuck happened to this guy? He sh straight up, he straight up, we bumped into him. And he was like, oh, you want to fucking fight, kid? Now he's like, oh, I mistaken you. You know, you are a fellow warrior, you know? <laughs> like, what the fuck? He did a total 180. This redemption from Joe is insane, dude. Fuck Morisaki, though. Morisaki can cast these fucking stray bullets, even in this OVA. Fuck Morisaki. Oh my god, she's still wearing it, bro. What is she fucking wearing? Dude, it's just fucking lunchtime. Dude, she just looks like... I don't know. She's the best MILF, dude. <laughs> Miss Maya? Wait, this is the ant, right? The who's actually in charge. In... Current in, in like season one. I thought this was mine. Never mind. Oh, got another Yotsuba milf. Another Yotsuba milf. She is not the head of Yotsuba right now. Because Maya took over the head after she passed away. Right? There's no way that Maya is the one planning all this shit, right? For some kind of succession war? No, right? But if we're talking about political motivations, wouldn't it be very convenient for the... Other, Maya to set this up to kill mom so that she can take over. I, I don't know. I don't know the relationship between the sisters. Is this all set up by Maya? Am I looking too deep into things? Oh, he called you by your first name again. Oh, oh. Yeah. <laughs> she cares more about that again. Bro. Oh my god. That slut. How dare he call me by my first name? Because he's so strong. Haven't you seen him? How dare you call her? We can't even call her by her first name. That's crazy. Wow. Oh, no, they're going to shoot Miyuki. No, not Joe! Wait, wait, wait. Miyuki got shot too. Honami did too. But Onisama should have, you know, the, the divine left. Divine left. That's demon right already? You... He's always had it. Restoration. And mom is dead. Which one will you prioritize? Miyuki, obviously. I've never heard him speak with such emotion in my life. What the fuck? That was actual voice acting from Onisama. He has godlike power. Oh, my? Onisama? Say it. Say Onisama, say it. There it is! She actually said it! Yeah, are we not gonna save mom? Yo. This is your fault, you dumbass. You fucking made Onisama go aside. Yeah, finish her right now. <laughs> no, no, demon right. No, finish her off. But if we save her, how does she die? Ooh. Yo, give him the fly. I don't think we have the flying suits at this age. Don't care about the mama, Honami. <laughs> Ooh. Because he only has feelings for Miyuki. And this is how the special agent's career began. Oh, Miyuki? Mm. Please go back safe. Oh, Onisama, please. Don't die. Oh, shit. Dude, look at that drip. Look at that drip, dude. Woo. Demon right, demon right, demon right. Spam that shit. It's unfair. And he'll heal them all up. It's just crazy how much impact he has on a team. He doesn't even need these guys. Honestly, like our, our supporting members are just a liability. It's just fucking dragging Onisama down and... Good for nothing? No, no. This is where Miyuki's like, no, that's, that's over. No, we're going to continue calling Onisama. Saved your ass too, mom. What, saving your entire fucking team? Like, what do you mean? You really consider him defective after what he's doing right now in the front lines and saving your ass? Are you insane? Bro, this is fucking insane. How are you this dumb? But he can do material burst! 
He got the demon right! He got the divine left! He can do this! What do you mean? You're insane, mom! I, 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 I don't even like... Yes, I understand what she's saying, but at the same time, that's only one specific aspect about being a magician. It literally doesn't matter. Like, re what? Magician can do regrowth, mom, huh? What the fuck is it then? It's godlike ability. You're like, it's not magic. It's a fucking miracle. He's a god. Insane. It's miracle! See? It's God's miracle! Insane to me. This, this mom is like, I don't care. Okay, she is super hot. Okay, yes, yes, okay. She's super hot. And they won't acknowledge it because he's not a magician in a traditional way. You don't need to be a magician. He's an actual god. Fucking insane. So they enacted the surgery for him to, to remove all feelings, right? They themselves actually did the surgery? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Implanting artificial brain, that's what caused it, except for the emotion for Miyuki. What about pain? What about pain? Does pain exist? Maybe I'm misunderstanding this, but basically that implementation kind of made him a magician. Before that, he had nothing. So, but now, but even now, he's still OP, but I, I kind of understand more now. At, at least she gave him that, I guess. Is, is that like something to be thankful for? I don't even know because that shouldn't have been done from the beginning. Ooh. It's just shooting artillery shots up and it just lands. Whoa, 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 what? That's it? Okay, so they provide us with backup, but... What's Onisama doing? Oh, he's doing all the fucking calculations in his head to get the perfect angle. Ponami? Ponami? Oh shit! She's goaded too! I mean, I mean, she is the personal bodyguard for the head. Comparable to Jumonji clan? She's cracked! I mean, she is the personal maid of the fucking, you know, head of the Yotsuba. What is this doing? It's just... Material burst. This is material burst! Boom! Oh, this fucking guy, bro. He, he had this as a kid? He just had everything! I assumed he learned this shit after he joined the military, but... No, he just always had it. Honami! Why, why, why? Did she use too much magic? What do you mean? End of your life? Why? For using too much magic there? Augmented magicians will exhaust their lifespan. So by her using all that power there, her lifespan was exhausted? Augmented? Because of something she wanted to do. For Onisama. Rejected mom. Was- is Divine left? <laughs> it looks- out of context, this looks ridiculous, right? But the happy thing is, we know from the intro sequence of this OVA that we have another maid that looks just like her. And I'm sure we treat her much better than the Yotsuba family ever would. Salute! Salute to the one that could rival the Jumonji clan shield. Maybe even better. What a great OVA. Technically, this this is pretty much a movie, right? And we still have one more movie that we're going to watch after season two. This OVA pretty much covered why Miyuki is so devoted to Onisama. In fact, you know how we kind of meme about the incest memes? Like, yeah, you could see that as fan service. And it definitely is pandering towards a Japanese fetish of incest. That's a common thing we see in anime. But there's actually a deeper meaning. The only feelings that Onisama has left after that surgery was his feelings for his sister. And that's incredibly sad if you think about it. So fucking sad. I don't think even Onisama understands to a degree like how kind of like how much what's the even word? How bad we should feel for him? I don't think he even feels that way. But so he was born as like a non-magician. That's why the Yotsubas were like, this is fucking useless. We'll just do surgery on you. And after the implementation, he could then still perform very mediocre in the specific way of testing a magician's power. It doesn't matter, because, you know, he has all these different OP magic. But even then, they won't acknowledge him. Like, that's fucking crazy to me. It's the Yotsubas are sometimes like, no, the butler was dumb as fuck. But when I hear the mom talk, I'm like, really? Like, you don't recognize him? You really think that after him just using divine left, you know, demon right, material burst, like, you don't think this guy's godlike? He's fucking doing miracles in front of him. She's like, ah, nah, no, he's just a fucking body. I know you're a place boy. We still don't know exactly how she died, though. That's, I guess, we'll find out in the future seasons, or maybe this hasn't been even explained, and it's coming in season three. I thought, personally, that the sister, Maya, because technically the aunt is now in head, the head charge of Yotsubas, right? If you're talking about political motivation for someone that wants to assassinate them all, clearly the sister is, like, main prime candidate. I'm not really sure if that's the case. Maybe there's a big plot twist. Who knows? But hey, 
if you're still here. If you enjoyed this reaction, please actually, we don't have to do that because it's Patreon only. I might actually save. I might do a little bit of edits and just like the thing about the movies and shit because this is just like three times the effort of a regular video and throws my schedule off. That's why I save movies and shit like this. Anything that's over like a regular episode's length, you just Patreon stuff. But I might just edit a little, little fun here. Like, I don't know, like only some like body and Joe and stuff. Anyways, look forward to season two. We're going to get started right away.